It has been like that for the past five years because uh, the, we can't, uh, you can't uh, imagine how bad the conflict is, the sectarian war. The country more than half destroyed uh, its uh, archaeological, uh, cultural uh, patrimony is already also mostly gone and uh, millions of uh, displaced, uh, hundreds of thousands of killed and f perhaps uh, this is uh, the, the largest uh, human exodus since the S Second uh, World War and regarding the uh, the standard that uh, was or the position of uh, the international countries like uh, uh, let's say opponent uh, 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 the western countries and uh, Russia and China of course Russia was uh, uh, more, uh, let's say, understanding our situation that uh, if the sectarian wars will go on, it will create kind of, uh, of uh, Islamic terrorists that will spread uh, very easily to other countries as it is now in the Middle East and even to Europe, and therefore even to Russia. And therefore, since the beginning, this agenda, geopolitical agenda of the West was wrong, and we heard many times from some, uh, uh, some uh, let's say, uh, 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 officials in the government in, uh, in the West, as well church leader, that regarding Syria as well Iraq, the, there were uh, conducting or, uh, or there were uh, following a wrong lecture of the events since the beginning. And now those who have been accomplices with this kind of, uh, let's say, uh, destruction, devastation, it's very sad to say they don't want to find a kind of uh, uh, repairs or to to re-examine their their, uh, their politics, and especially we have, uh, to my knowledge, to uh, to my understanding, an agglomerate media that doesn't help in in resolving politically situations in Syria and in Iraq.